Hi, I'm Tristan with Shoot Straight. Thanks for joining us for part two of our pigeon cartridge test. Today, we're going to be using ballistic gel to rate the top five cartridges from the first part of our test. If you haven't seen that video, I'll put the link in the description. For anyone who hasn't seen ballistic gel, it provides an accurate simulation of soft tissue. What does that mean? Well, it means that we can use this to see exactly how far the pellets from a cartridge will penetrate into flesh. Maybe it's a pigeon, a pheasant, partridge, whatever. So just to recap, our top five cartridges are in joint first, we've got the Ely Pigeon HV and the Hull Superfast Pigeon. In third place, we've got the Empire Lead 30. In fourth, we've got the Live Ale Express Pigeon Power. And in fifth, we've got the Fiocchi Pigeon 32s. First thing we're going to do is to chronograph all five cartridges. This will allow us to establish the average velocity of each. We're going to set the chronograph up at two and a half meters from the muzzle. We're going to shoot five cartridges to get an average. This table shows the average velocity and pellet weight for each cartridge. You'll notice that the Live L Express Pigeon Power are not only the fastest cartridge in this test, but they've also got the heaviest pellet. Conversely, the Empire Lead 30 are the slowest cartridge in the test, with the lightest pellets. So here we've got our ballistic gel. It has to be kept in a cooler in order to make sure the temperature remains stable. We've measured out 50 yards and we're going to shoot each block three times to make sure that there are enough pellets in it to be representative. Here you can see a ballistic gel block that's been shot. As you'll notice, not all of the pellets travel quite the same distance. So when we do the results, we've tried to give an average that's representative of the cartridge. Let's look at the results. So the cartridge that penetrated the furthest at 6.9 centimeters was the Live L Express Pigeon Power. Second place went to Hull Superfast Pigeon. Third place went to the Fiocchi Pigeon 32s. Fourth place went to the Ely Pigeon HV. And fifth place went to the Empire Lead 30. It's worth looking at that the Live L Express Pigeon Power were the fastest and the heaviest pellet in the test, whereas the Empire Lead 30 were the slowest with the lightest pellet. If we combine the results of our two tests, it would see the Empire Lead 30s come in 5th, the Fiocchi Pigeon 32s come in 4th, the Ely Pigeon HVs finish 3rd, the Live L Express Pigeon Power come in in 2nd, and then the winner of our Pigeon Cartridge test would be the whole Superfast Pigeon. Thanks for watching. Join us next time when we put a 12 and a 20 ball head to head to see if there is a difference between the two calibers.